All right. Okay, we're going to determine the left and right end behavior of the graphs of these two polynomial functions for very large values of the absolute value of x. And we're just going to have a little side note that every time we're going to find the end behavior of something like this, you are going to um, determine that by your leading term, which is a sub n x to the n power. What you're really going to look at is this first term here. When you have your coefficient 6 with your x to the 8th. And since it's x to the 8th and this is even, it's going to um, act like a x squared function. So it's going to end up looking like a parabola. So on a graph, since your 6 is positive and you have an even, positive is going to open up. So your n function will look like a opening up parabola for that one. Okay, so this one's a little bit different. Um, this one is actually going to be odd since both of your powers here are odd. But your leading term is going to be this because it has the higher power. So technically, you're just looking at that part. So when you graph it, You're going to have your negative 2, so it's going to be your opposite. But since it's odd, it's going to look like the cubing function. And since your coefficient is a negative 2, it's going to be reflected over the y-axis. So it's going to look like this. 